you movie lovers! Today, we're diving into the magical world of the 80s, guided by none other than John Hughes, the mastermind behind some of the decade's most unforgettable films. Let's count down his top 10 movies, according to IMDb ratings. Grab your popcorn and let's start our Throwback Thursday journey. At number 10, we have Mr. Mom. Picture this, Michael Keaton mastering the art of being a stay-at-home dad. It's hilarious yet touching, as Hughes explores changing family dynamics and gender roles like never before. Moving to number 9, Ferris Bueller's Day Off. Come on, it's Ferris Bueller! Matthew Broderick's epic day off is a wild ride through Chicago, filled with humor and rebellion that can't be missed. Number 8 brings us National Lampoon's Christmas Vacation. The Griswolds doing Christmas? Absolute chaos and pure comedy gold, thanks to Chevy Chase's brilliant antics. At lucky number 7, we hit the road with planes, trains, and automobiles. Steve Martin and John Candy, as mismatched travel buddies, give us a Thanksgiving journey filled with laughter and unexpected heartfelt moments. Halfway through at number 6, National Lampoon's Vacation. It's the Griswolds again, but this time, they're on a cross-country trip to Wally World. Cue the disasters and Chevy Chase's comedic mastery for a laugh-out-loud adventure. Number 5. Some Kind of Wonderful. This touching story of love and friendship tugs at the heartstrings, with memorable performances by Eric Stoltz and Mary Stuart Masterson. Sixteen Candles lands at number 4. Hughes's directorial debut and a teenage saga that perfectly captures the angst and ecstasy of high school life. Molly Ringwald and Anthony Michael Hall turn awkward moments into movie magic. And now, top three. At number three, it's Uncle Buck. John Candy shines as the lovable, if a bit disastrous, Uncle Buck, stepping in to take care of his brother's kids. Pure comedic brilliance. Pretty in Pink takes the number two spot. Molly Ringwald dazzles us as Andy, a girl torn between love and societal expectations. It's a poignant look at teenage life and class struggles. And drumroll please. At number one, The Great Outdoors. John Candy, again stealing our hearts, this time as Chet Ripley in a vacation gone wrong comedy that's both wild and witty. So, what do you think of this list? Did your favorite John Hughes movie make it? Drop your thoughts and any movies you'd add to this list in the comments below. Hold on. Wait one second. Something is missing. You thought we missed it, didn't you? What about the best John Hughes movie? A bonus on today's list, we're adding The Breakfast Club, where five high school students meet in Saturday detention and discover how they have a great deal more in common than they thought. Now we're done. Like, share, and subscribe. See you next time at the movies.